Hello guys and welcome back to the world of Skyrim. Last time we played we found out that there we are something called Dragonborn and we were summoned to the throat of the world by Grabius. And also we are now Thane of Whiterun, which is awesome. But uh, I thought that now we could actually do some uh, uh, helping the little folk, so to speak. But first, I need to eat and sleep. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. I think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. If it's... I enjoy this work well enough. Are you joking? You just rented a room from me. Oh, sorry. So... We sleep first and then we eat. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. You are looking to become a merchant? Before my Ma and Da passed, I told them that one day I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. Hmm. Maybe I can help you. You do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? Sounds good. You mentioned the trading caravans. Yeah. These Khajiit make a living traveling the roads and selling their wares. Oh, right, right, right. It's got to be tough. Skyrim's a hard enough land when you've got a roof over your head. Worst thing is, nobody wants them in the cities. Nobody trusts them. Why not? Reputation, mostly. A lot of Khajiit turn to smuggling and thievery to get by. A few uh. bad apples spoil the bunch. You know how it is. Yeah, yeah, I get it. What do you know of Khajiit? About the same as everyone else. They're the catfolk of elsewhere. Great warriors, good traders. Way I hear it, elsewhere ain't nothing like Skyrim. It's got tropical forests and dusty badlands. It sounds awful. Not to me. Actually. You want a drink? No, actually, I just want to eat. Yeah, let's see what we have. Stew and bread. Carrot. Is that enough? Yes. Okay. Let's see what we should do first. Mm, my guild are clean. Bandits. And let's see where he, where he is actually. Oh, there. Okay. Yeah, let's um, sing Spanish Jam. Seemed good. Uh, let's talk uh, to the yeah Yannick, uh, Danica first about the tree. Hey, Danica. Welcome, child. I heard something happened to the tree at the temple. The Gilder Green, yes. It's a bit of an eyesore at the moment. More of a problem for the pilgrims than for me, but not many of them around anymore. What's so special about this tree? To the east of here is a hidden grove where the Elder Gleam resides. It's the oldest living thing in Skyrim, maybe all of Tamriel. Our tree here in the city was grown from a cutting of that tree. 
you can still feel the glory of the mother tree brewing. Even its name is an echo. Is there any way to revive the tree? I've thought about that. Trees like this never really die. They only slumber. I uh. think if we had some of the sap from the parent tree, we could wake up its child. But even if you could get to the elder tree, you couldn't tap it. Not with any Norman method. What kind of weapon would work? Elder Gleam is older than metal, from a time before men or elves. To even affect it, you have to tap into the old magic. You'll have to deal with the Hag Ravens. I've heard about the weapon they've made for sacrificing Spriggans. It's called Nettlebane. The Hags terrify me, or I would have gone after it myself. I guess I'll get the Nettlebane for you. Your spirit is strong. Kinareth's winds will guide your path. It's held in a Hagraven nest called Orphan Rock. Perhaps we should pray for Kinareth. One hundred gold. <laughs> Fine. Actually, what did, what what it gives us? Um. Oh, stamina about twenty-five. Okay. Fine, I guess. Okay, let's go to the bandit camp. Let's try to get that elk. Yep. Yeah. I did hit him, but pretty much no damage at all. Oh, there it is. Straight to the butt. A fucking skiver. And I fucking missed. and hold on to it. I'll be back for it later. I'll pay you good. Don't lose it. Um no time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I mean it. Oh, what's there? Someone run past just now. I presume this impure bowl of burning belongs to you. Yes. How did you get them? I'm going to track down that thief, murder him. Ah, found you. So he's a thief then. There you are. You thief. <sighs> Does he want to say something to us? Need something? Nope. Okay, what do we have here? Doesn't seem too very friendly. Okay, they are throwing their weapons already. Hello? Hmm. 
Oh, wheat. Are you a friend or foe or what the fuck you are? Oh, bandit. Oh. He Don't give up. Get them, bandits. Freaking thieves. Yeah, take that. Ah, uh, yeah. Good here. Potato, potato. Spigot? No, I don't need it. Oh, I'm full, alright. Okay. Honey. Eva Stone Singer. Big bucket. Skooma? Drugs, but then uh, I guess I can sell them. Smuggler's trade notes. The new source has been a real boon. Skooma, poisons, black soul gems, you name it. We got a line that wide range of goods and even wider range of clients, which reminds me Sanoma needs to tell Akari where she can stick her bottles of sugared cat piss. We're done. Meanwhile, we're filling up our coffers faster than we can empty them. We're drinking day and night and still we ain't gonna throw half of the gold from what Morrowind chop for the Corpse fundlers. With the Argonian patrols up and down the border, we can charge an arm and a leg and a tail for every crate that comes in. As for the zombie petters, they were pretty pleased that the staff wasn't damaged. Creepy looking thing too. Was glad to be rid of it. It's a shame we couldn't hold out a couple more days though. This morning Alana Baya came out. Came by the camp and Orc with face of so lumpy, he must jump head first of the double dragon reach. Turns out he was looking for the same staff, offering to pay double. I'll top him, told him we could have something better for him on the next board from Soul's time, but he was pretty sudden clear that there was only the one staff he wanted to buy. Makes sense. The only thing uglier than this orc was that staff. Maybe he wants to hold it up when he shaves so he doesn't feel so bad for being born. <laughs> Rough. Any, anyways, I sold him the information on the buyers and sent him his way. Couldn't get him to trade any of the valuables in his carriage. But it's alright. There's more than one way to part a fool and his things. I told the boys to cut him off the road west of Whiterun. At the burnt down house between Watchtower and Fraud Greymore. Given how he obsessed was obsessed he was about the staff, it'll be easy to catch him off guard. Hmm. Dangerous thing trying to fool an orc. I guess we could try and cook something if we can. Apple, apple, cabbage soup. Anything else? Potato soup. Potatoes. Rubby hunch. Okay, we are out of salt. 
Grazie, ok. We're one of the same kind, you and I. If that is what you wish, lead on then. Okay, there's a horse if we wanna use that. Can we use it? Oh, it's stealing, okay. But how you would... Oh. There's something on the carriage. Okay, money. Good. There's a battle axe too. But uh, it's so heavy. I don't want to... Ah, shovel. Go away. But it's so heavy that I don't want to... I don't want to carry it around. But yeah, we got a little, little uh, sidetrack. Let's go to the bandit camp now. Okay, do. How we should do this? There are archers there, so I don't really wanna get shot by them. Get shot to the wall. Okay, let's try to draw them all one by one. Come here, you ugly bitch. It's nothing. Oh, I, I missed. Oh god, oh no, mage. Oh, fuck. Kill this magic boy. Oh shit. Oh, he runs off. Oh fuck. Oh. No, of course I don't have any stamina potions. Get it. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, nice. Right to the eye. Okay, let's get this Robin Hood. Yeah. Oh, you're ignoring me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> For the light. Okay, let's see. Um, by the way, did I miss a chest on that call we were earlier? Ah, oh, freak, I think we did. Okay, I think we have to go back once we are done here. Okay, they've been butchering uh, mammoths, it seems. Okay, one bandit was here. Steel mace. Mm -hmm. I thought about becoming a bandit. I decided I preferred clean clothes and fresh meat. <laughs> Good choice. I didn't want that axe. Well, actually, I could use that actually, so I can cut some wood if I need to. To earn money. But there, uh, let's go inside and deal with the bandits. Okay. Let's see what we find here. Oh. Huh? Ha, found 
Okay, come here, yo. Ah. There you go. <laughs> right in your neck. Okay, we got a key. Do we have a big axe already? Yeah, we have. Don't need, don't need another one. Okay, we have a mammoth's tusk. That we can sell. Let's take a few. I'm, I'm not sure how much, um, how good price they actually give, but... Okay, there's iron ore here. We can mine it later when we, um... Uh, when we clear the mine. Is the chief? Gotta have a sharp axe to cut through all that fat. Okay, there's another magic boy. I saw that axe. I was pretty sure. Yeah, that's the that's it. That's the end of it. <laughs> ah, okay, let's start that again. Oh, fuck! Damn those two-handed weapons. Fucking magic bitch. There you go. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, let's. Okay. Only the chief left. Oh, he can take a lot of beating. Oh no. You're down. Oh no, you're not. Okay. You motherfucking bitch! <laughs> yeah. Uh. Oof, oh. Iron axe of fatigue. Blood of gold too. Steel armor. Yeah, I could use that actually. Oh, that. Imperial gauntlets. Okay, let's change armor. Yeah, that's a lot better. But uh, I do lose the good gauntlets now. Haha! It doesn't look, uh, we don't look like a paladin though, but then uh, it takes time. Get a nice set. Okay, what did you have? Nothing? <laughs> Not big surprise. But you. A little bit of gold. Culture set. Okay, let's see what you had here. There are a lot of tusks. Let's go. How much can that <laughs> woman carry? Hmm. You know, traps in here, okay. What? Lord Wall of Stone. 
What the hell is that? Smith mineral ore. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, please. The, um, the stone is full. Seems important, at least. Silver. And let's get back to the cove that we found earlier. I think I missed a chest there. Yeah, yeah, we did miss a chest. Yeah. Okay, let's see if there's anything good. Well, a little bit of money. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh. 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 Uh oh. What's this? Okay, there's another magic boy. Yeah, there you go. Okay, get the Argonian. Stop using that magic shit. Better luck next year. <laughs> Okay, let's try this again. Okay. 
we are pretty full of stuff. Perhaps we just uh, go back to White Run and sell all the stuff. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Oh, hello. Hands only. Let's see here. A letter. Not sure who from. He wouldn't say, just that he was a friend of yours. Looks like that's okay. it. Okay. Got to go. Letter from a friend. Ethan Lightbearer, you caused a bit of stir in the planet mayor when you demonstrated the power of your thumb. Oh yeah, I accidentally uh, used a shout in the in the um, in. Not everyone is anxious for the return of the Dragonborn. I, for one, desire to see you grow and develop your talents. Skyrim needs a true hero these days. You should turn your attention to Vogue's gig. I understand it holds a mysterious source of power that can only be unlocked by Dragonborn. Sincerely, a friend. Okay. And where is this Vogue's gig? Oh, there. Okay. Okay, not going there anytime soon. Although I should join the Imperials army though. I always set some aside for myself. Thinking of settling in. In the south. It's a house for sale. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravan. Here is your mammoth's tusk. Thank you. This should turn that old cat's gaze. Maybe I'll be able to become a caravaneer myself one day. As promised, let me show you a thing or two about bargaining. Don't want some shifty merchant giving you a raw trade. Thank you, my lady. Farewell. I can assure you it's all fresh. I hunt. Okay, there was that one pound to you from the Avenici. Tried mercenary work? I serve Jarl Balgrum as steward. Yeah, it's a... Oh, it's a... Lust costs so much. The bandit leader at Hollet Stream camp is dead. I'm here for the bounty. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. One hundred gold for risking my neck. Also died a few times. Ah. Is there anything you need of me? Of course. It's all in this note. Okay. The shadow. I apologize for secrecy, but I'd rather not speak of the support of y'all in the event the information I received is incredible. He has enough on his plate at his you see, earlier last week I received a tip from an unnamed source regarding a potential assassination plot on the Yarl. Now while we take all threats seriously, it is difficult to know just how credible the source is. And with everything that's happened as of late, I don't have time to investigate this myself. That is why I like you to head to Arcadia's Cauldron and Check their ledger for any suspicious purchases, in particular poisons. I've asked Arcadia to leave you a copy on her counter. Look it over, find out who purchased bottles over the last few days, and confirm the reason are legitimate. In the meantime, I'll have one of our cooks check every piece of food, bottle of meat, and leftover breadcrumb just to be sure nothing is tainted. If your investigation turns up nothing, then another information I received is false and the yell is safe for the time being. If not, I hope someone of your reputation can take care of situations swiftly. Well, I think we should dare. Get this done ASAP. Okay, let's do some enchant 
disenchanting. Okay. Well, it's a uh, yard's alive on the stake, so I think we should get this done ASAP. Do you get to the cloud district very often? Oh, what am I saying? All I can think about is my son, my Thorold. They say that he was killed, but I know better. I know my son is alive. Those bad were born. They're in with the Imperials. They know it's true, and yet they lie to my very face. How do you know? You? How do you know they're lying? It's not wise to discuss it here. Please. If you truly wish to help, meet me at my home. I'll tell you the whole story. Okay, well. Maybe a bit later, I have important things to do. I'll be sure to bring some back for you. That's something just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Okay, we have to check the. Uh, yeah, the ledger. Commander Gaius, stamina potion, ability, potion of strength, two shot, extreme healing, your disease, potion of magic, and that's the priest of RK, viral and poison, okay, that's inspicious, blacksmith potion, resist cold and gentle potion. Potion of haggling, potion of healing, malign lingering potion. Okay, minor stamina, potion of the night. Okay, we have to go to the stables and the um, the, the bur burials. But okay, let's see what they have to say in their defense. Oh, there you are. Sometimes forget how much I miss the company of a woman. Tell me, do you believe in mighty RK, god of life and death? Well, the god of death, I know him very well. I'm glad to know that because I need your help. You see, I've lost something precious. What did you lose? My amulet of RK. It's the source of my divine powers and also a sacred badge of office. I misplaced it in the catacombs. I'd look for it, but I have been hearing noises down there. And I fear the dead have become restless. Without that amulet, I'm powerless to confront them. Would you be willing to search for it? I'll find your amulet. East. I'll just wait here and make sure nothing foul escapes the catacombs. The blessing of Arcade be upon you. And with this terrible war, as White Run's priest of Arcade spread his word and let our Okay, let's see what what's the problem here. Okay, I hear rattling. Uh-huh, skeletons. Nice. Ah! Whoa. Oof, oof. Okay, more of you. Ah.
Moral and poison. Right, there it is. Fever. Skiver trouble. Since no one else seems to be doing anything about it, I've taken steps to rid ourselves of the skiver problem. Please do not eat this cheese as it lays with dangerous poison. I repeat, this cheese is skivers only. If you feel the need to take a bite, I implore you to look in the mirror first and confirm that you are a skiver. <laughs> if so, you may eat at your heart's content. If you're not a skiver, then you can better serve RK by staying alive. <laughs> Unusual gym. Okay. Uh, so, AM. The priest is free of any suspicion regarding the yard's life. Yeah, I think we are clear of any undead. Okay, there's the amulet. Let's bring it to the priest. I, spend so much time I found your amulet. Oh, thank okay. Please. Take this gold for your troubles. No problem. Happy to help. The blessing of RK be upon you. Okay, let's head to the stables and see what, why why they bought a potion of poison. Dark Elf was not smart to choose me. Scars, it up. Scars aside, I can pass as a stable boy easily enough. I'll tell the shopkeep I got I got bucked by a wild one and landed face first in the into the briars. I'm smart like that. <clears throat> the other bandits always poke fun at my face, same I look like a newborn babe, but it comes in handy for jobs like this. After seeing how well the dark of pace, the entire gang will be looking for a razor pretty soon. Speaking of which, I'm supposed to meet my mysterious benefactor back at the stables and not at the silent moon camp. I'm not sure why, but he says I'm followed. It's best I stay in character until I'm well clear of city gates. Well, I hope he doesn't sneak up on me while I wait. I nearly sold myself for the last time. But a smart guy that I am, I bought... I bought this tome to help me find him. Thing is, I opened it up and I can't... I opened it up and can't for the life of me figure out how it works. Only a matter of time though, for a guy like me. Okay, Silent Moon Camp, okay. Uh, wasn't I there? No, it was this right? Okay, Silent Moon Camp is a little bit... A little bit there. I mean, next to the... I was. Yes. Perhaps I can uh, sell my stuff to the shit. The longer we travel the road, take a look. Okay, we should head to the. Actually, I should sleep first. The air is so clear. Okay, we got a level up. Let's see what we need. Actually, we could take uh, one magic point. Oh, another level, okay. 
Well, health is good. Okay, okay. What should we um, level up? A speech would be nice in alchemy too. Damn, so much for I could actually put some skills in it. Okay, we do one speech. And damn. Actually, we could put one to enchant. Okay. Let me know if there's anything else. Okay, we are now at uh, level nine. Hey. Be careful. Get the fuck out of my way. Okay, and now we are off to the uh, Silent Moon camp. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed oh. to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Looks like uh, that's it. I got to go. I guess. Hey. <sighs> nope. Sorry. Almost the last of fucking mud crap. <laughs> Some paladin I am. You're a joke. <sighs> oh look, it's a little mud crap. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh, I can take you. Okay. What, what do I do with you? Oh, it's a ingredient. Okay, I'll eat you. No. <laughs> there right up there nope what oh A freaking saber key. A fucking mage. Where is my... Oh, she's up there. Well, that's just great. Let's uh, go the other way. Oh, and there comes the magic bitch again. I will. Is the magic beast dead? No. Yield and I may 
I won't. It seems there are a lot of bandits here. No, you're not gonna shoot me. Ow. Why everything have to hurt so much? Uh, how many people are up there? Oh no, another magic user. gonna fucking die Anna fuck <sighs> we were starting so well did I fucking miss that How I am I missing everything? Finally. That motherfucker. How did I miss that too? Missing everything. Where's the other dude? There. Okay, let's save here. Good potion of healing, good, good, good. Okay, what's the deal with here? I think I have to get the go to the above first. I can get there, I think. Ah, but first these bandits. Where are they now? Okay, now they're coming. Here they come. charge with the sword stop hitting man I think I have to drop the stuff for now. Oh no. There you go. Ah, bandits come.
What might you need? Hmm? Let's go. Assassin's Journal. The bow has been long a player in the game. It has doubled many in a piece. From a yards to kings, it does so without sight or sound, save for a rattling crown on a bloodstained floor. And yet it's been far too long since it's had a chance to tilt the board. Relas Guile failed to topple a piece. Dram took the flesh but not the soul, and the game went out without incident. Now the pieces sit idly by, refusing to move in the idle comfort. Even now, as I take aim at the target, I hear the indolent yawns through the door of my bowstring. Yet the board cannot remain level forever. With the bow in my hand, it will be tilled once more. However, the timing must be right. The top toppling of a piece rings hollow in a thunderstorm. I must wait for a quiet moment, one that's intimate, when the yell is not engaged in talk of war and dragons. If the battle for Skyrim comes to Whiterun, I will be forced to redraw. But there will come a time when he sits idly by in his grand hall, unbothered by the world. In that moment when the Yarl has a chance to finally breathe, I will sneak my way to the upper floors and make sure that breath in his make sure that breath is his last. And when I take my leave cloaked in the shadow, all, all anyone will hear is a rattle. Okay, the Jarl's life is indeed in danger. Once we loot this, loot this place, I will lay, uh, return to Jarl immediately. Say yeah. Trap door. What was that? Did you hear something? Guess I was just hearing things. 
Yep, that you are. So little room to do anything. behind her. What's I swing at you? Oh, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Sorry about that. I guess that's that for that camp. We should return to the yar immediately. Well, the assassin. <laughs> okay. One shot, one kill, right? Let us handle this Jarl. And there he goes. Bow of Shadows. Ooh. It's a nice bow. Okay, the threat is over. Now we can talk to the Jarl. Us two were coming. Wake up, Provinces. I serve Jarl Balkrum as steward. I found the assassin and took care of him. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. 
500 for saving y'all's life. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. Okay, perhaps I should uh, sleep and sell my stuff. Ah oh, shit, I forgot to disenchant. Oh shit. Yes. Let's go. Okay, I sold my, all my junk that I could and uh, the traders didn't have enough money for them but then um, I also made myself a new hand gloves well gauntlets and the um, actually this is the other time that I have for today so thanks a lot for joining oh, and years, but I earned my way to the top shut up I'm trying to do ending jobs. speech successful business obviously yeah <laughs> well then every thanks everybody for watching and the uh, I will see you in the next video bye